Hey, hey everyone, everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to, to Five Minute Eats. All right guys, today we've got another frozen burrito review for you. And this one is one of those cheap frozen burritos that you see at Walmart and you're like, oh, that's so cheap, it looks a little scary. And it is of course the Tina's Red Hot Beef Burrito. We previously reviewed the be Bean and Cheese Burrito. Check that out in the archives. But today we have the Red Hot Beef. Of course, like every other microwave burrito, it's split down the back, but. And let's face it guys, nowadays there's a lot of frozen gourmet mm -hmm. burritos, but Tina's was the one who dominated, I feel like for what, like 30 years? Mm -hmm. When you think of frozen burritos, it was Tina's. And nowadays you go to Walmart, you can buy them individually, but they also sell them, I believe, like in a 10 pack or something like that. These are cheap, these are, I feel like, as a guy, these are great products because um, let's face it, if you're a single guy and you want a burrito, you're too lazy to go to the the local Mexican restaurant. Ye old Taco Bell. Exactly. <laughs> this is your best you know, option here. Yeah. And now this one is um, red hot beef. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. So I guess that's going to be spicy. Spicy? Yeah. That's what I would think, right? Now guys, if you're new to our channel, basically we review everyday grocery items. So before you spend your hard-earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. That's right. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right, guys, I'm ready. I'm ready. So our rating system, thumbs up, we'd buy this again. Thumbs down, we would not. So guys, for me, this is a thumbs up. And the reason is this burrito is spicy. I love it spicy. But the real reason that I like this is because there's a lot in there. Compared to the bean and cheese we tried, I feel this is packed. Now, interesting thing about this, even though it says beef, I feel like the beef, you don't get a whole lot in there. Mm -hmm. And the beef that you do get in there is, I believe, shredded beef. It's like, it's like crumbled, I think, like yeah. the ground. So I don't even really like mm -hmm. see it in there when I'm eating it. Mm -hmm. It just, I see a lot of whatever this, um, what would you call it? Sauce, sauce or gravy or something like yeah. that? Yeah, and there is pinto beans also yeah. in there. So the sauce and the pinto beans, that's what I taste primarily. You do taste uh, like the beef, but it's more the sauce, man. And the sauce in this is a star. I like it. Okay. Because it's like a chili. Mm. Ch uh, chili, that's what this you know tastes like. Mm -hmm. It does taste like a chili. Now for me, this one is gonna be a thumbs up. I really like this one. Like this one is amazing compared to the other one. This one is a superstar. Now I love the spice level on it. It's pretty spicy, but it doesn't like stay with you. Like yeah. it dissipates pretty quickly. I feel like you can taste the beef, but again, it's one of those things where you don't much see it, but it, there's like a beefy essence in there, but it's mainly just like this kind of all one textured, mixture in there which is a little bit of a mystery but it's fine it's an 88 cent burrito you know but hey it's 89 cents don't cut the thing um too short or what is it <laughs> is that the phrase here yeah don't sell it short don't sell it short exactly <laughs> give it that extra penny but here's the thing um the the flavor is great it tastes awesome especially like for an 89 cent burrito, it tastes good, but even for a more expensive burrito, because some of these ones, the fancy ones that we get at Costco and Sam's, they don't taste all that great. Yeah, there's a huge disappointment with some yeah. of these gourmet burritos. Yeah, and this is a nice, just little like workhorse burrito. So guys, to sum it up, thumbs up, thumbs up. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means guys, we can continue to review things. All right guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.